you've been involved in so many businesses over the years. Uh, do you sense that uh, the ethical behavior, integrity uh, uh, is improving, declining, staying pretty much the same in, in business today? I think in business it's pretty much the same. After Enron and all the rest, I think there's been a trend to try and uh, to uh, at boards of director levels and everything else to try and and and, and emphasize uh, integrity and, and emphasize uh, the uh, the reasons for good governance. But I don't think it's gotten better or worse, except in government. I think uh, the 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 our current uh, our current two party system. Uh, spends all their time throwing mud at each other and not really forging solutions. And the truth is uh, they should be doing that first and then they can have their fist fights at election time. And you think you can spot integrity when you meet people or shortly after that? No, I think you miss that. Uh, you, you can't. It's not something. It's not a badge. You, you don't mostly see it until there's an issue. I mean, there's Everybody's kind of uh, you know, follow the law and, and and try and be. You can check somebody's background and you know, find out if they've got some maybe have alcoholism problem. They got a, some other kind of problem. You can find out and they, is, it, is is there is this a recoverable thing? But uh, I don't think you can really see it right away. But pretty soon you understand. You know, you understand who's going to you know if there's a problem, who's going to be standing up and who's going to be sitting down and who's going to be pointing finger at somebody else and who's you know, they, uh, uh, that's always a, a crisis, really. There's always a value of a crisis because you see who stands up.